Hi everyone, I'm Marina Carfrey, three-time Ironman world champion. I'm gonna show you some strength exercises and active recovery moves. Being a professional triathlete, I do a lot of heavy swim, cycling and running. Some days I might be out training for eight hours, other days it might be you know, three or four hours. I do a lot of active recovery in my training. It's like yoga to weightlifting. Now the first exercise we're going to do is called lateral lunge to a single leg reach. I'll use five pound dumbbells for this one. And basically you step to the side, lunge, and then to the single leg reach, your knees at 90 degrees. This one really works your glutes on the lunge, but the single leg, you're working the leg that's standing. A great active recovery move for that exercise is lateral gliding. You'll stand with your legs further than shoulder width apart. A squat down, reach forward, and then glide from side to side. You should feel your adductors, which is inside of your thigh, opening up. The next exercise we're going to do is the counterbalance squat. I start with sand bells to raise my heels. Just so it gives you a little more range of motion. You can actually get further into your squat as well. Basically, you squat down and hold out the dumbbell in front of you. A really great active recovery move for that exercise, or for any exercise really, is what I call the world's greatest stretch. You start off in a quite an aggressive lunge position. Reaching up to the sky and then come down. The next exercise we're going to do is a box jump. Box jumps are a plyometric exercise. They're a very explosive exercise. I like doing box jumps because they help with my running being explosive and quick off the ground. So here we go. One thing to think about when doing a box jump is to land as quietly as possible. One of my favorite active recovery movements is called the founder. You start out with your legs in a fairly wide position, hinge your hips forward, and at the same time, bring your hands forward and just above your eye line. You're sitting back as far as possible and all your weight is through your heels. I'm an endurance athlete and every day my muscles get broken down by the hard workouts that we do. Recovery sessions I found have really helped me perform better when I go back to cycling or go back to running after being in the gym. And after a hard workout, you definitely need a lot more than just water. I go for a high quality protein, um, some carbohydrates and electrolytes and you need to get those in the right mix to help recovery. And low fat chocolate milk does just that. It helps your body rehydrate and replenish after a tough workout. I don't think any triathlete ever feels like they are the best they could ever be at swimming, cycling and running. It's a constant juggling act and I think that that keeps it interesting. There's always something to work on. There's always something that you can improve. So um, yeah, I mean, I'm still chasing the perfect race and I'm 15 to 17 years in.